Is reality interdimensional? In this video, we're gonna explore the mind-expanding idea that we exist in some sort of a multiverse, that there is so much more to the mystery of life than the physical universe that we can perceive with our senses. And there's also so much more to what we are, to the mystery of consciousness within each one of us than anything that modern science has even begun to discover. For many decades now, the scientific community has speculated about parallel realities and alternate dimensions. And physicists have even developed entire mathematical theories around these concepts. It's interesting to note as well that for thousands of years all around the world, ancient cultures have taught that there do indeed exist these alternate planes or dimensions of existence beyond the physical universe. Not only are these fascinating ideas to consider, this video is going to share why this exploration of interdimensionality affects us in a very real and practical sense, and why this could actually be a profound key to the evolution of humankind and to consciousness itself. Welcome back to Cosmic Consciousness. My name is Jonas and today I'm coming to you from Jamaica where I've been living and working as a professional psychedelic facilitator. Please check me out at innervisionpsychedelics.com to learn more about that work. Now I do want to say it's a little windy here today and we got some waves crashing in the background so I apologize if that's picking up on audio but let's dive right into this. What if I told you that the vast majority of reality is actually invisible to our five physical senses. This here is a book called The 4% Universe, which explains that all the physical matter in the universe, all of the countless stars in the sky, all of the planets, all of the trillions upon trillions of galaxies make up just 4% of the observable universe. The other 96% is invisible to us and completely unknown. It's called dark matter and dark energy. Our most advanced science has no idea what either dark matter or dark energy actually are. They're complete enigmas. 96% of this universe is a complete unknown. All of our oceans of knowledge and information is a fraction of a slice of 4%. I mean, it is truly awe-inspiring to consider just how beautiful and bizarre and mysterious this roller coaster ride of life truly is. And all this raises the following question. I mean, what, if anything, lies beyond the physical universe that we can perceive? Now, as I mentioned previously, theoretical physicists have long considered the possibility that we do exist in some sort of a multiverse, that there are alternate realms or dimensions or planes of existence outside of space and time. String theory and M theory are just two examples of scientific theories that postulate that reality must be multidimensional. And in quantum physics, the many worlds interpretation theorizes that there are infinite parallel realities as a possible solution to the measurement problem of quantum mechanics. So the brightest minds of science today almost universally agree that it's very possible, if not probable, that we do exist in some sort of a multiverse. Now here's where things get even more interesting because all throughout human history, people have reported exceptional experiences in non-ordinary states of consciousness where they directly encounter these transcendent planes of existence beyond the physical universe. Mystics, shamans, spiritual visionaries, and psychonauts from around the world have reported these experiences of accessing or tapping into transcendent realms or dimensions of existence outside of space and time. And in fact, all of the world's major religions attempt to describe and even map out some of these interdimensional planes of existence. I mean, Christianity, Islam, and Judaism all describe heavenly realms of existence. In Buddhism, the Tibetan Book of the Dead is just one example of an attempt to describe and map out the multidimensional structure of reality. And Hindu texts describe an elaborate system of lokas, or planes of existence, with innumerable universes existing all at the same time. 
So if we connect the dots here on modern scientific knowledge with ancient spiritual teachings, it's fascinating how many parallels there are around this idea of multiverse theory. And I believe this all very, very clearly suggests that not only is reality interdimensional, but so are we. We are multidimensional beings living in a multidimensional mystery of life because we're fundamentally interwoven into the very fabric and structure of reality. And here's where we come to the idea of consciousness and more specifically, cosmic consciousness. For several years now here on this channel, I've shared evidence supporting the idea that the consciousness within each one of us is transcendent. It's beyond this one physical lifetime. If we look into research of near-death experiences, mystical experiences, shamanism, past life memories, psychedelic visionary states, remote viewing, astral projection, and the whole field of parapsychology, the data from all of these different fields all universally agree that there is more to what we are than this one physical body. For example, hundreds of thousands of near-death experiencers from around the world have all universally shared these out-of-body experiences of journeying to other realms or dimensions of existence outside of this physical universe. And research into the powerful psychedelic molecule NN-dimethyltryptamine has found that over 50% of DMT users describe encountering alternate planes or realms of existence beyond space and time. If you ask me again, the conclusion is very, very clear here that we are not human beings having multidimensional spiritual experiences. We are spiritual beings who are right now having a human experience. Whether we call it consciousness, soul, spirit, life force, chi, true self, the Buddha nature, there is something within each one of us that is beyond this one human lifetime. See, modern science teaches us that consciousness emerges out of the physical universe, out of the complex interaction of neurons in the brain. But there's another completely different possibility that the physical universe emerges out of consciousness. That consciousness is fundamental. It's beyond space and time. It is a fundamental quality or aspect or property to existence itself. To use scientific terms, this is known as non-local consciousness. The idea in quantum physics that consciousness exists outside of space and time. It's transcendent. So the idea behind this video is to open the doorway to a more enlightened, more spiritual worldview that is still very firmly grounded in science, but extends beyond the limitations of a purely materialistic or physicalist understanding of this mystery of life. And it's just like my favorite Nikola Tesla quote on this channel, the day that science begins to study non-physical phenomena, it will make more progress in one decade than in all the previous centuries of its existence. The day that humanity recognizes that consciousness is cosmic, it will unlock all kinds of new scientific breakthroughs. It will help us evolve and awaken and come together with a greater sense of connection and unity. So thank you so much for tuning into this video. If you enjoyed this video, please check me out at Patreon where you can support me in making more videos just like this one. Thank you so very much and I'll see you back here very soon.